hi everyone in this video i am going to discuss logic gates please press subscribe button not gate also known as inverter it produces an inverted version of the input as its output and it takes only one input and produces only one output now when input is zero then you can see in the truth table the output is one and when input is one then output is zero operator for not operation is dash uh, and bar operator please look at the symbol given below how a bubble is placed over there so input is x and the output is x bar in the truth table x is the input column and x dash is the output column that is basically the not x and gate an electronic circuit that accepts two or more inputs and produces single output it gives output one or high when all inputs are high or one operator is dot operator x and y can be written as a dot b you can see the symbol of and gate uh, with the inputs a and b and the output is a dot b or ab to table x y are the input variables and the output side has got x and y or x dot y or x y you can observe in this truth table that when the combination uh, of the input variables are 1 1 means all inputs are true then the output is 1 rest outputs are off or gate an electronic circuit that accepts two or more inputs and processes single output it gives output high or 1 when one or more inputs are high or 1 operator for and operation is plus example x or y can be written as x plus y or it can be read as x or y you can see the symbol of uh, the or gate and now in the truth table you just see that x and y are the inputs and x plus y is the output and we observe that uh, wherever even a single one is there the output is one and when all or off or all inputs are having value zero the output produced is zero now NAND gate an electronic circuit that accepts two or more inputs and produces single output it gives output low or zero when all inputs are high or one a and b can be written as the complement of a dot b you can see the symbol below uh, of the nand uh, gate and uh, in the truth table you can see the two input variables a and b and y is the output and now uh, this y is basically the a nand b and uh, you can see in this truth table then where all the inputs are high uh, or 1 uh, then the output is 0 or false and everywhere else uh, it is true or 1 now here you can see that NAND is a combination of AND and NOT gate and uh, in the first picture you can see that uh, first the AND gate is there its output A dot B has been sent through the NOT gate and finally we get the complement of the uh, AND actually that is the NOT AND that means NAND and in the second one straight away the symbol of NAND is there uh, and it uh, has got uh, AND gate with a bubble bubble is basically the NOT gate one more thing uh, students that NAND and NOR both are known as the universal uh, gates they are called the uh, universal gates why that will discuss uh, in some other video uh, later NOR gate an electronic circuit that accepts two or more inputs and produces single output it gives output one or high when all inputs are low or zero uh, this thing you can observe in the truth table also uh, for the input variables a and b uh, when the a combination is 0 0 then the output is 1 for rest of the rows the output is 0 uh, a nor b can be written as the complement of a or b uh, in the symbol of the nor gate also you can observe that the bubble of not gate has been placed after the uh, or gate now here you can see that uh, nor gate is a combination of or gate and not gate uh, first picture is of nor gate and in the second one uh, first the OR gate is there and then the output of the OR gate has been passed through NOT gate NOT gate is there separately so it is producing the complement of the OR so actually it is the NOR gate NOR exclusive OR it is also called ZOR gate it's an electronic circuit that accepts two or more inputs and produces single output it gives output one or high when there are odd number of ones in its input combination symbol you please observe two inputs a b output is a or b observe the symbol for the zor operation that is n circle plus 
in between A and B. Now we observe truth table, observe input combination and the output as well. First combination 0, 0, no one is there, so the output is 0. Second row 0, 1, so single 1 is there, that is odd, so the output is 1. Third row 1, 0, single 1 is there, that means it is odd, so the output is 1. Last row two ones are there, combination is 1, 1, so the output is 0. Now the three variable exclusive OR gate with the inputs A, B, C. Observe the symbol uh, or the operator for the ZOR operation now in circle plus. Observe the truth table. Odd number of ones, output is 1. So first row 0, second row single 1, 1, third row 1, again odd, so 1, then 0, 1, 1. Even number of ones, output is 0, 1, 0, 0. Odd number of 1, single 1 is there, so the output is 1, 1, 0, 1. Again, the output is 0 because there is even number of 1s, then 1, 1, 0. Again, even number of 1s over there, so the output is 0. Last row has got 3 1s, so there is uh, odd number, output is 1. Exclusive NOR gate, also called XNOR gate. It's an electronic circuit that accepts 2 or more inputs and produces single output. It gives output 1 or high when there are even number of 1s in its input combination. Means ZOR gate, odd number of 1s in the input combination, XNOR, even number of 1s in the input combination, then it produces the output high. Observe the symbol of the gate, two inputs A, B, and the operator which we use for the XNOR, that is N circle dot in between A and B. Now we observe the truth table and we check it out whether it is correct or not that even number of ones produces uh, you know uh, output one so what is unique about it first row where the input combination is zero zero there also the output is one actually uh, x naught is a complement of the zor operation so it was bound to happen in the first row when the output was zero zero in the zor output was zero so here it is one Next row 0, 1, odd number of 1s, output is 0. Second row, input combination 1, 0, single 1 is there, that is odd number of 1, so output is 0. Now last row when the combination is 1, 1, that means 2 1s appear over there, so that is even, so the output is 1. Now the 3 input XNOR or exclusive NOR gate with the inputs A, B, C. Again observe the operator and circle dot. After that we observe the truth table, first row, no one is there, output is 1, second row, single one is there, that is odd, so 0, third row, only 1, 1 is there, so that is odd, output 0, fourth row, 1, 1, even number of 1, so the output is bound to be 1, it's x naught, then 1, 0, 0, single one is there, odd, output is 0, next is 1, 0, 1, two ones are there so that is even output is one next row one one zero so again it is even so the output is one last row three ones appear one 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 so the output is zero because that is odd number of ones over there next lesson that is about NAND and NOR as universal gates please do not forget to share and subscribe do press subscribe button below my video